Heads up, while most of my content is family friendly and suitable for all ages, Phoenix Wright Trials and Tribulations is a game that has been rated T by the ESRB rating system, and as such the videos in this Let's Play are likely to contain mild blood and or violence possibly at the same time. So viewer discretion is advised. So Iris, how are you doing on all of those locks you're supposed to be undoing? She's not doing anything. <laughs> She's just like, hi! <laughs> hi! <laughs> the night of the crime. I think it's time you told the truth about what you were doing on that night. You said you were in your room at Hazakura Temple the entire time. Do you still claim that to be the truth? Yes, that's where I was. Iris... I believe you're innocent. That's why I want to believe what you're telling me, too. But I can't. Because this person saw you somewhere else on the night of the murder. Mmm. I wonder if Pearl is like, My powers are gone! But in reality, she was just like, Dahlia stole them! <laughs> no, no, in reality, she was the <laughs> she one- She was possessed no. by Jafar. <laughs> <laughs> no. Maybe she was the one who did the channeling. And it was like, she went to Elise Donum and she was like, you need to channel this person and blah, 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 blah. And then she was like, I don't like how this is going. And no, thanks. Leaves I'd rather with her not. gravy and potatoes. You were seen by me. <laughs> no. Well, Iris, I trust you, so you need to trust me. But, Mr. Wright, I can't. Why not? I can't trust such random nonsense. It doesn't make any sense. Oops. Looks like I screwed up there. <laughs> I'm talking about Sister Bikini, of course. Sister Bikini. Her testimony in court today was very clear. Yeah. That night I was helping an acolyte with her training in the inner temple, but, well, as you can see, my back likes to act up violently. So I left Iris to help the acolyte and return to Hazakura Temple. I really hope that me, Maya, I almost said Mia, Ma, Mia, Maya, Meanie, Maya didn't- Eeny, Meanie, 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 Meanie. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, I hope Maya didn't get murdered by- Yeah, hopefully not. Dahlia. Sister Dahlia. Bikini didn't just see you, she spoke with you. You two talked about Maya's training that night. So you see, Iris, you were there at the inner temple on the night of the murder. That's very impressive, Mr. Ray. The Acolyte's actual training was due to start after 10 o'clock that night. I left the main hall early so I wouldn't be late. What time was that? Let me see. It takes about 20 minutes to walk between the main hall and the inner temple. It takes five minutes to go across the bridge. Into the inner temple. Into the inner temple? Five Pro minutes? Kiss the girl. Oh, I don't wanna... Oh, 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 no, 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 you don't just start heaving and throwing up while you're crossing a bridge. <laughs> that Phoenix did. Okay, I don't think he did. No, this is, this is like that thing in Animal Kingdom where they're like, cross the bridge over the alligators and crocodiles, and they're like, ah, but you have oh, like oh, the bungee cord. Oh, and Kilimanjaro cord. safaris. <laughs> no, not, Kil not in Kilimanjaro safari. That's like the separate thing. No, there's like the part where you're on the butt, like the safari w wagon, car, whatever it is, and it goes over the bridge and it's going whoa, 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 like purposely. Does it? Oh, I didn't If you don't walk over it, that would be completely unsafe. No, there's there's a tour thing, though, where they walk over it and you've got a bungee cord on you, so if you do end up falling, you, you that's, caught up before that the... I, I agree! Seem, I agree! Uh, I don't think that's true. I would have left at about 9.40 p.m., I think. I'm sorry, Iris, but lying just doesn't suit you. Huh? Now, you say you left the main hall at 9.40, but what you say doesn't add up with this. Well, is it because of the... Oh, ring the bell, ring the bell at 10 p.m., Iris? I don't know what that voice was. <laughs> yeah, I don't either. Ring the bell. Wait, that works? Why wouldn't it? If it takes 20 minutes, you're in the inner temple when oh, you whoops. do the thing. <laughs> I thought that was i thought it was a different piece of evidence you presented, but I'm that's sorry, okay. Mr. Wright, but mistakes just don't suit you. Huh? I had hoped you would get at least this much correct. I hate seeing you mess up and getting all disappointed. Well, maybe Phoenix... Uh. Well, if she doesn't end up being the murderer, maybe, like, Phoenix will, like, get with her. 
if you know what I mean. Well, because he, he loved Dahlia. So maybe if he doesn't love someone who's creepy. I feel like because they're I, identical, I agree. always seeing the person... I, basically always seeing the person who tried to kill you even though it's a different person. I that agree, would mess with you. but maybe it would bring new memories and happiness for him. Maybe. maybe. I didn't know she could be so harsh. <laughs> Iris, what are, you trying, what are you trying to hide? The more you lie about it, the more I know it's got to be something really important. <sighs> well. I thought you presented this because mm -hmm. we received it before the Lights Out bill was rain. Yeah, both work. Both work. You yourself testified to the contrary, don't you remember? You said you rang the lights out bell at 10 o'clock that night. Which would work. Uh. Plus, only moments before you rang the <coughs> bell, you were seen at the main hall by the most reliable witness I have. Who's that? Me. Mr. Wright. We even spoke a little that evening. That's when you gave me this. Surely you haven't forgotten. No, that's right. I remember. What if we met Dahlia? <laughs> and she dyed her hair and she's like... <laughs> you need this. And that brings us to another puzzling fact, Iris. At 10 o'clock on the night of the murder, you were seen in two different places at the same time. Yeah, because it's spirit channeling. It's time you told me exactly what's been going on, Iris. So far, I've managed to prove two things. First, on the night of the incident, you were at the inner temple. Whoa. And second, at the exact same time, you were ringing the bell at Hatsakura Temple. There's only one possible explanation for this apparent impossibility. There were two of you. <laughs> <laughs> that is the right one. There's only one of you, Iris. You couldn't possibly have been in two places at once. That being the case, you were probably really at... Mr. Wright? Yes? What is it? That's what I wanted to ask you. What was that probably you just came out with? I, um, well, the problem is you spoke to witnesses at both the main hall and the inner temple. It's kind of hard to disprove either sighting, but... That's no position for a lawyer to find himself in, is it? No, she's got me there. It seems to me like there's just isn't a solution to this puzzle. It's probably best if you just forget the whole thing, Mr. Wright. Yeah, like we're gonna do that. Yeah, I'm not doing that. <laughs> <sighs> On the night of the incident, you were seen in two different places at the same time. Which means there must have been two of you. I can't think of any other explanation, Iris. But, but that's crazy! How could that be? There's only one of me. It's impossible! Impossible? I wonder. The way you're trembling certainly seems to suggest otherwise. <gasps> you're seriously trying to suggest there's more than one of me? Then show the evidence! Show me something that proves there's more than one of me. You know what I just had an idea for? What? Someone should make a dubstep version of this song. Oh, I would love to hear that. That would be so good. Do you even know what dubstep I can't sounds like? Do, I can't make dubstep sounds. That also doesn't sound like No, it doesn't. I can't make dubstep but sounds you really, in my mouth. You really had a weird... <laughs> anyway, let's figure out the evidence. Uh, let's show the deceased. Yeah, that's person. what we have to do. <laughs> Pearl. Hey, check it out! It's Godot! <laughs> uh, Mr. Wright, when you said there was another me, I was kind of expecting someone who looked like me. You know? I... I guess so. In that case, are you saying that I look like this person? Yes! <laughs> well, I can't say with 100% certainty, I mean, but... You both like coffee! <laughs> Can you show me something that you're 100% certain about, then? I really need to get to the bottom of this. Iris is determined to hide something from me. She remembers. I can't drag it out of her until I can show her some irrefutable evidence. Irrefutable evidence! I'm sorry, Mr. Wright, I don't mean to uncooperative, but... You're seriously trying to suggest that you can travel through time? Yeah! <laughs> hey, Dahlia. I have a firm grasp of the situation now, Iris. You have a sister, don't you? A twin sister, perhaps? <gasps> That's right, Dahlia Hawthorne, a woman I know only too well. The... Yeah. I had no idea you knew of her. Very impressive, Mr. Wright. But she's no longer... Yes, I know. How... Oh, you've been keeping in touch that much? Her sentence was carried out recently, wasn't it? I'm sorry. Thank you. There's no need to explain now, is there, Iris? 
This second you who was here at the temple at the night of the murder, it was your twin sister, Dahlia Hawthorne. But, but you just said it yourself a second ago. My sister's dead. Haven't you forgotten that? Have you forgotten this, Iris? This is a channeling dojo, a training ground of the Korean channeling technique. That night, someone channeled Dahlia's spirit, and you knew about it. And that's the secret you've been trying to hide from me. <laughs> meanwhile, meanwhile, Francis is like, "What the fuck is happening?" <laughs> I was in my room in the main hall that night. As soon as I heard that I'd been spotted in her temple, I knew. I knew it was my sister, Dahlia, the other half of me who passed away last month. Just as I suspected, the iris that Sister Bikini saw at the inner temple on the night of the murder. It was Dahlia Hawthorne. Why didn't you tell me this before? Be because... Because my sister always does the right thing. Um, what? Do you? Have you never met her? You have never met her! <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> and because I mustn't get in the way of what she's trying to do, I already betrayed her once before. I can't do it again. You betrayed her? What do you mean? That's why I... I have to accept I may be found guilty. It's the only way. What is she talking about? The traitor. You know about it, don't you, Mr. Wright? About the fake kidnapping that took place here on Eagle Mountain 11 years ago? No! I didn't know about it at all! <laughs> <laughs> that was the start of it all. It twisted her entire destiny. She started to commit crime after crime, and in the end, she lost her life. I mean, yeah, but... She was a terrible she person. She was a terrible person. <laughs> it's all because I betrayed her. How did you betray her, Iris? It was no coincidence that Eagle Mountain's where the exchange was to take place. After all, I, I helped plan the whole thing. How many what? people were in on this planning? Did they have a group text going out like, Okay, you're gonna meet here, you're gonna be behind the tree, you're gonna set up the camera, and you're gonna come and get the money. <laughs> but can we please not invite- Invite who, Amon? <laughs> oh, it's Uno Lock, the like, evil sorcerer, so, but incredibly boring and unpopular. <laughs> oh my gosh. Maybe she was the one who set up the camera. I, I totally want in on this plan to take down Bovin. He's way hey, too, too awesome, awesome in power. power. <laughs> But I got scared, so I ran away. Yeah! Good for you! What are you talking about? Why would you help her? Stealing two million dollars? From your own father? That's awful! But I promised. I promised that I'd help. And... She didn't do it for the money. Huh? It was revenge on our father. Re revenge Please tell me this isn't gonna turn into, like, the most terrible, like, do father takes, like takes ownership of his daughters in terrible ways. What do you mean by revenge? He was a hideous man. He threw our mother away and then sent her to hell. Her mother? She must be talking about Morgan Fay. Our mother was the eldest daughter of the main branch of the Fay family. The main family had lots of influence in many business and political circles at the time. As the eldest daughter, our mother was sent to inherit all of that uh, of the, as the next master. That's the reason our father married our mother in the first place. For power. But his plan backfired. Because our mother's sister took it all from her. She took over as the master of Karain. That would be Misty Faye, Maya's mother. Everyone, basically, if there's one thing we've learned from Phoenix Wright, everybody's just like, Misty Face sucks! <laughs> like, she ruined my life! <laughs> but she makes pretty good picture books. <laughs> she does. <laughs> but before long, the credibility of the Korean tradition hit rock bottom. The new master, Mystic Misty Fay, made a terrible mistake. Again! No, misinterpretation. Misinterpretation, of... and she got all the correct facts, it's just the, the dude was the, like... The, the ghost dude... didn't know it was Von Karma who shot yeah. Who Stupid Von Karma! You Stupid ruined Von Karma. literally everything! Everyone's lives! <laughs> Von Karma opens the I door. didn't do anything. <laughs> All I did was eat an entire file. <laughs> and shoot a guy. Minor <laughs> mistake! <laughs> it was destiny! 
I really, really wanted to take the elevator instead of the stairs. <laughs> Have you seen those stairs? They're the worst. <laughs> My stupid shoulder has a bullet in it. <laughs> My doctor said I should avoid going on the stairs. <laughs> They ruined my back. I had to go to the spa 12 times to get rehabilitated. I love how even though he's dead, he lives on. <laughs> I know. It was during the investigation of the DL6 incident. After that happened, our father took me and my twin sister away, leaving our mother and our home behind. He hated the place. He said it was a hick dive and then he had no reason to stay there. And that's when you came here to Hazakura Temple? Yes. The woman my father took as his next wife already had a daughter, Valerie. I... I had no place in his new family, you see. How would you, like, ditch one twin? Like, that would be tough. I don't know how you would ditch one twin, but literally, there are so many ca Again, this is a Japanese game. Mm. Memoirs of a Geisha, and, like, so many things where they're like, Well, can't have two daughters! Here you go! <laughs> and just, like, send her to the temple, or to the Geisha house. Or <laughs> same thing. <laughs> same thing. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh. And I haven't seen my mother once since then. But you have! No. No, never mind, you haven't! Wrong, <laughs> Wrong <person>. mother! <laughs> also, Mor you don't you, you wouldn't you like Morgan one? Fish. She drinks paint. It's kind of weird. weird. She's got I like mean, a you, salad bowl you hair know style. Your, <laughs> you know your half sister? Because I'm guessing Pearl also didn't come from the same father. That would be weird. That would be weird. <laughs> I don't want to go into that. Morgan. <laughs> Having the master's seat stolen from her and being rejected by her own family? I heard she's been very battered, spiritually and emotionally. I think I'm finally beginning to see how the pieces fit together. We've been beginning to see that for a long time. I have asked her everything I can in my capacity as a prosecutor. This incident, everything related to it, goes back to the history of the Fey Clan. That's what it looks like. Everything. Oh, there she's back. Iris, there's just one more thing I want you to tell me. What is it? During the incident in which your sister Dahlia Hawthorne poisoned a lawyer, she began relations with a certain college student in order to hide the evidence. That college student, have you heard anything about him? Well, I did hear one thing. She said she hated his guts. I mean, yeah. I see. Thank you for your help. You're welcome. <laughs> Hurry up, Phoenix Wright! There's still much to investigate. Did she whip her or us? <laughs> Leave these locks to me. I'll open them for you, I promise. Thank it'll you. It'll just take two days, and it'll be One the day. middle- It'll take- It'll be the middle- She hasn't done any of them! <laughs> None <laughs> of them are that's gone! That's true! <laughs> She's just like- <laughs> There's still five back there, so it'll be- You like... haven't even unlocked the one you know you can open! <laughs> She's just like... Ooh. Thank you. I suppose I better continue my investigation. There's still one giant secret left to unlock. Yeah, a certain five Cyclops. Pearl Cyclops. <laughs> five of them. <laughs> what is it with five Cyclops in this case? Well, that's like the max people can have. That's the max the screen can hold, even though yeah. for Pearl could have had eight. There, Pearl could have had eight. There's enough room on Pearls for eight. I think but that, that, that cool. would have been excessive. That would have been amazing. Hey, Pearl. Uh, Pearl. February 9th, me. Heavenly Hall. Look at that! They really did make a fire right in front of his shack. Oh! Mr. Nick! Ha! You're too late, Nick. If you came here for one of our potatoes, we've already polished them all off. I think I've pretty much got all the evidence I need. Now I just need to find out what Pearls is hiding. Okay, well, here we go. A Pearl. <laughs> the night of the crime. After dinner on the night of the murder, you were supposed to be in Elise <clears throat> Donham's room, reading a book together, right? Yes! I was so happy when she invited me! But... I didn't go in the end. You didn't go? No. There was somewhere else I had to go instead. I was so worried I... I had to go! I didn't know what to do with myself. I was so nervous. So Pearls never went to Miss Donham's room. Because she was too worried about something or someone else. Pearls? On the night of the murder, you went to this place, didn't you? 
Yeah, it's pretty obvious. We can uh, just click wherever. <laughs> On the <laughs> mountain. You went here, didn't you, Pearls? Looks like she's still not going to open up to me. This is where you went because you were so worried, right? Then the next question is, who or what were you so worried about? Now, I'm going to take a guess, and you can tell me if I'm right or wrong, okay? You mean you know? If I'm right, will you tell me the whole truth? Okay. You went to this place for one very simple reason, and that is this. Godot was serving free burgers up there! <laughs> <laughs> well, Pearls, this is what you were worried about, right? There's something I'm worrying about right now, actually. What's that? You, Mr. Nick. Your face has turned a really weird color. Huh? You shouldn't work so hard, you know. You need to take a break once in a while. Being chided by a nine-year-old. How embarrassing. Your face is a viridian. A viridian. <laughs> but there's really only one thing Pearls could have been worried about that night. She must have been worried about her. There's no one else it could be. I'll go get some sheets and make up a bed for you. No, no, it's okay. I'll die of pneumonia if I nap in a drafty little shack like that. Guess I'm gonna have to think this through one more time. I like how Pearls and Larry are hanging out. <laughs> I think it's funny. You went here, didn't you, Pearls? Looks like she's still not going to open up to me. Oh, just the same dialogue. Mm -hmm. uh, yep. Question is, who or what you were worried about? Burp, 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 burp. Oh, I just realized there's room technically for ten oh. Cyclops on here. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. <laughs> yeah. That would be too okay. much. That would be too much. And that's this. It's obvious that you, what you were so worried about, Pearls. It was Maya, wasn't it? Uh. You knew the training Maya was undertaking was dangerous. After all, it was the special course. I signed, er, I signed up for your special course! Well, my, my, my! Quite brave of you, considering how cold it is. Young people can be so reckless with their health. Don't blame me if you become one with those you channel. <laughs> Sister Bikini scared you with what she said, didn't she? And because it was you who introduced Hazakura Temple to Maya in the first place, you felt responsible, didn't you? Thinking about what could have happened to Mystic Maya made me more worried and worried. I couldn't sit still at all. That's why I decided to go and find out how she was doing in the Inner Temple. Well, that was one. <laughs> Just one! <laughs> <laughs> then we're clear now that you went to the Inner Temple that night, Pearls. What's not clear is what happened after that. Uh... About what time was it when you headed over to the Inner Temple? Um, it was probably around 9.30 when I left the main hall. I heard the real training was supposed to start at 10. I wanted to get there before it started. But there was so much snow, so I didn't get there till after 10 o'clock. Until after 10? How did you know what time it was? Because I heard the bell ringing for the lights out. She heard the lights out bell? The Hasakura Temple's bell is pretty small though, isn't it? You must have really good hearing. I... I was really trying to pick up the sound of the bell, that's all. I, I didn't want to miss it. That would be terrible. She was trying to hear the bell? Tell me, Pearls. Why were you so worried about hearing that bell? Huh? Oh, I... I think I know why. The reason you were so worried about that bell was because of this. Literally, none of this would have happened if Pearl had just shut her mouth and we didn't go and gone the to the middle. picture book reading. <laughs> no, if we hadn't just gone... If we were like, snow sucks, we're gonna stay home. None yep. of this would have happened. It's true. <laughs> <laughs> you were worried about this edition of Oak Cult <laughs> Magazine. <laughs> you know, Mr. Nick, I think you should take a break now. Huh? Even your hair's starting to look a bit tired. The spikes aren't so looking so sharp. Looks like picking this piece of evidence wasn't so sharp of me either. I thought it was she would break the fourth wall and be like, you should stop playing this game. <laughs> <laughs> stop playing the game? Never. I'll never stop. This game is way too good. Anyway... You said you couldn't afford to miss the sound of the lights out, Belle. Huh? Oh, I... I think I know why. You know what it is? Is it because of the, uh, the burnt letter that we found? Yeah, because it mentions the lights out, Belle, in there. You were given some instructions to follow for that oh, night, no. weren't you? Oh, no! Oh, no! Pearl! 
I presume you recognize these pieces of paper? Ah! Where did you- In the incinerator at the Inner Temple. Pearls. You were following the instructions in this letter that night, weren't you? That's why you couldn't afford to miss the sound of the lights out, Belle. I... I'm speechless, Mr. Nick! You're amazing! These instructions that were found in the incinerator... I believe they were written for you, Pearls. For me? I... no! As you can see, a large portion has been burnt. But the last section is still fairly legible. As soon as you hear the lights out bell, you must channel her spirit. Pearl, I know exactly what happened and I'm so sorry for you. Who gave you this letter? Who? Who was it, Pearls? Whose spirit were you supposed to be channeling? Taking into account the offer of the note and their purpose for writing it, whose spirit would Pearls have been trying to channel? Don't overthink it, Phoenix. It's pretty obvious who Pearls was supposed to channel. The person you were trying to channel that night, Pearls, was... Mia. <laughs> it was Mia. <laughs> well, Pearls, am I right? I... I can't channel anyone anymore. A spirit medium who can't channel spirits is like a painter who can't paint! Poor kid. It's really getting her down. But I have never channeled that person's spirit! That's bogus! That's You've done bogus. that like 20 times! Yeah. Uh, I should have all the evidence I need, so what am I not getting here? <laughs> He's like, it's like there's someone controlling me and purposefully <laughs> getting all the wrong notes. <laughs> that would be great if they broke the fourth wall there. Oh, whoops. Wrong, ba, ba, wrong ba, state. Ba, ba, it's fine. Ba, 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 ba. It was Dahlia Hawthorne, wasn't it? That was the name that was in the letter. Uh. We still have two. It's just as I suspected. Yeah, just what I suspected too. It wasn't Iris whose sister Bikini met at the Inner Temple that night. It was Dahlia Hawthorne. With her hood. To s disguise the red hair. Or she didn't have red hair. <laughs> Dahlia if, if... Hawthorne has red hair! But remember when, like, Maya channels Mia, Mia has black hair even though Mia normally has brown hair? So technically if Pearls channeled Dahlia, Dahlia would have come in with brown hair because Pearls has brown hair. But, but Pearls so... has a different color hair than Dahlia. Yeah. So the hood does make sense yeah. for that part. Uh -huh. Do you know anything about her, Pearls? Do you know what kind of a woman Dahlia Hawthorne was? Um, no. I've never heard of anyone by that name before reading those instructions. I thought so. Pearls doesn't have a clue. She doesn't know that Dahlia is her sister. Looks like Pearls got all the sweetness out of that one! <laughs> yeah. About the instructions in the letter I found, Pearls, who wrote them? Um... Whoever it was asked you to channel the spirit of someone you never heard of. You must have quite a lot of respect for them. Wait! Really?! Why would they do that?! Why? 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 Why would they do that? No! <laughs> why would Elise Donum be like, I need you to do this for me? <laughs> She's like, oh my gosh, well, I don't- wow! After all, you followed their instructions without question. <gasps> oh gosh, Harry Potter! <laughs> so here's my next question. Who wrote this set of instructions for you to follow? Why? Does she want to kill Maya? This is the person who wrote the instructions, isn't it, Pearls? You must have had a lot of faith in them to follow their instructions to a T. I... I've had a lot of faith in you, Mr. Nick. Oh, thanks! But... I don't think I can trust you anymore! Who else would it be?! She Ouch. doesn't have any- No! Pearls sure can be blunt when she wants to be. <laughs> Someone who Pearls, Pearls would, would trust, trust, no questions, questions asked. asked. There can't be many candidates for that post. Whoever it was that asked you, hold- Wait, whoops, that was the wrong safe state. <laughs> Wait, okay. Morgan is in jail. Jail, jail, jail. How does that <laughs> work? <laughs> How does that work at all? She can't just be like, I have a letter to deliver to- <laughs> <laughs> That was the best voice ever. I have a letter to deliver <laughs> to my precious <laughs> pearl and Potter. <laughs> to <laughs> <laughs> If she's like, I have a letter to deliver to Pearl, my daughter. It's just a murder plot. It's just okay. a murder plot. They're like, okay, how does that work? You're only, I thought you were only allowed to write in prison, like maybe once a year. Was she like, I'm, That's, saving, I'm saving it <laughs> for this moment when I know that Pearl's will be, this is so we're, dumb. Okay, hang on, we're going to learn more. This is it'll, so dumb No, right it'll now. make currently, sense. It will make sense. Maybe it will, but currently it's stupid. Okay. Pearl's, I have to wonder about something. 
You didn't have any idea what these instructions meant, did you? But um. <laughs> oh wait, that's Pearl's heart going. But um. <laughs> oh yeah. Um. But um. <laughs> I like. I like Phoenix just playing with Detective. But um. <laughs> but you followed them to the letter regardless. Why? Because it was your own mother who asked you. That's why. How did you? She doesn't even trust her mom. I figured it out. The person who wrote you this letter was your own mother, Morgan Fay. Uh. <laughs> All right, Pearls. It's time you started telling me the truth. Why is she holding back from me? I don't like this. D -d don't underestimate me, me just, just because I'm a ch child! Huh? If you're trying to say that I followed these instructions, I I'd like to see some proof! What?! <laughs> because I, I d -d don't think you have any! Mm. She'd say anything rather than admit to carrying out those instructions. I guess I'll have to produce some more evidence then. One more thing should do it. All right, Pearls. We both know someone carried out these instructions on the night of the murder. But you're right. There's no evidence that proves it was you. Uh, I, I knew it! However, I do know that whoever did it was a child. Huh? How do you know that? It couldn't have been an adult. No adult would have made a simple mistake like that. A simple mistake? What do you mean by that? I'm sure you thought you were carefully following the instructions you'd be given, but you misunderstood some of the words, and this is the evidence that proves it. It's like, Pearl, you don't know anything that you're reading. Let, <laughs> let me look at it. Sneeze the lights, you must channel her spirit, live it, leave everything up to her, blah blah blah, her name is, she's our ally, the whole... She has a picture. Not pictured. <laughs> uh, once this is burn that, also make sure not to tell anyone about the letter. Gravely roast the master in the fire of Hades and bring our vengeance to fruition. Fruition, Mark. <laughs> fruition! <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, you don't know anything that that means. She's a child! This shows the mistake you made. Um, I guess you know what I'm about to say, huh? I don't think it's me who made a mistake, Mr. Nick. It's you! But the person who read these instructions must have been a child. That's why they misunderstood the meaning of that word. It's the only explanation for how such a simple mistake could have been made. Uh... Okay, I'll go over again! <laughs> the person who read the instructions! <laughs> why wouldn't it have... But... Okay, let's look at other stuff. What else would it have been? Is it because- wait. Let me see the letter again. I, I wonder. Yup. Yup. Mm-hmm. <laughs> it's because she threw the pot roast on her. <laughs> That's hilarious! Wait, no, I definitely have enough evidence. I, I forgot you can just back out of it completely. That's amazing! She was just like, I don't know, put the gravy roast on <laughs> It was you who splattered gravy on the Haining Scroll, wasn't this it? This is amazing! Uh, what? Why would I do something like that? Do you remember what it was written in that letter? Gravely roast the master in the fires of Hades and bring our vengeance to fruition. But you didn't know how to read the words gravely and roast among others, right? Uh, how did you know that? Remember the conversation you had with Miss Donum on the night of the murder? <laughs> Perhaps we can read some books together. Really? I'd love to! I am- I'm not very good at reading. <laughs> well then, would you like to practice reading with me? Miss Elise? So, for example, how do you read this? It says, gravely. That's kind of a tough word. Oh, I forgot that, uh, that was a part of the conversation. <laughs> yeah. Sure, Miss Donham taught you how to read gravely and roast. But what she didn't teach you is what they meant. Gravely sound like gravy to me, and the only roast I could think of was food. And that's why you did it. That's why you covered the picture of the master in gravy from the night's pot roast. To be honest, I did think it was a bit strange. I guess I really did get the wrong idea. Just a tiny bit. I... I really am useless. I didn't even manage to burn the letter properly as my mother had asked of me. Such a simple thing, and I couldn't even do it right. 
That's the longest Psychlock break, I think, in the series. Oh. It wasn't that bad. It's the only one where there's five and you break them all individually. Break them all and it's not just like... Psh, psh, psh. Yeah. I... After dinner that night, I did go to the Inner Temple. With a pot full of the leftover gravy. I thought she was just gonna eat it. No, that entire... Ugh. Sorry. <laughs> Dis disappointed. I got so excited. The gravy? I saw the picture on the hanging scroll near the sacred cavern. I was sure it was the Master of Karain, like it said in the letter. I see. And then? Well, it was already way past ten when I got there because of all the snow. So I went to the Inner Temple guest area. The guest area? Yes. I thought I could wait there until the training was over. Why didn't you just go to the training hall? Because Mystic Maya's main training had already started and I couldn't interrupt it. Okay, you could have interrupted it, kid. It's okay. So I just stayed when, where I was and prayed for her to get through it. But then, I... Pearls, did you fall asleep? I'm sorry! I didn't mean to! I just couldn't help it! Hey, don't worry about it, Pearl! Who cares yeah, if you fell asleep? was here the whole time! <laughs> I fell asleep waiting for Iris too. It happens! <laughs> anyway, then you found yourself trapped at the inner temple? Yes. When I woke up, it was morning. I tried not to cry, but... Dusky Bridge wasn't there anymore, and there was no one in the training hall. I thought everyone had left me because I overslept. Oh, I've actually had nightmares of that before. Where I've, like, overslept, and then, like, the house is in flames, and everybody just left me inside because I overslept. <laughs> because I've slept through fire alarms before. Slept through them, or you're just, like, woke up, you're like, it's probably nothing. <laughs> that also has happened. <laughs> that one time. I knew... I already knew it was fine because mom came in. She's like, it's fine. I was like, okay. And I went back to bed. <laughs> the next, mor next morning, Artie was like shooting daggers. <laughs> like with his eyes. Because Link and I are like, we hear the smoke alarm. We jump out of bed. Like everyone, like everyone's going off. We get the cats, get them outside. Like in case. Because, yeah. you know, it doesn't just go off for smoke. It goes off for carbon monoxide too. That's well, kind of I was young. Too. I didn't know carbon monoxide existed then. At any way. And I was like, well, there's no fire. It's probably fine. Oh, I, I read that as I threw up in the incinerator. <laughs> <laughs> I threw up in the incinerator. That's why the letter looks so bad. No, I threw the letter into the incinerator, then I heated up the leftover gravy and... And let off some steam by chucking the gravy on the scroll while you cried. It does kind of look like she just threw up on the scroll, though. <laughs> it must have been pretty scary for you, Pearl. I know what it's like. Nick used to leave me behind when I fell asleep at school, too. Don't equate something so trivial with her experience, Larry. Well, she looks fine. It was written right in my mother's letter. It said, as soon as you hear the light out bell, you must channel her spirit. I was on my way over to the inner temple when I heard the bell ring. So you channeled Dolly a Hawthorne spirit? No. I tried, but I couldn't do it! You couldn't do it? I've never failed at channeling someone. This is the first time it's happened. So in other words, Dolly is alive! <laughs> Great. Great! So, super, ugh. This means then who someone... died in the execution? <laughs> a scapegoat. <laughs> a decoy. <laughs> that doesn't even make sense! <laughs> um, I don't know. <laughs> I tried and I tried and I tried yesterday this morning the whole time here's the thing that doesn't make any sense to me that I'm like Morgan whatever <laughs> because how would she know that there's a lights out bell at this place it's not like she's gone here she like, how may have she... okay when she, she had a whole butt ton of time while she was busy not being the master <laughs> that's true but okay let's say her, she her did. daughter lives here she doesn't visit her daughter she doesn't I mean, love that her is true. Ouch! But that's probably true! It's true! <laughs> I just couldn't do it! D don't let it get you down, Pearl! It'll all work out! If you want, I'll come flying through the sky for you! Whoosh! Just like that! So she never managed to channel the spirit. Is that why you think your spiritual powers are gone? Yes, I... I don't know what to do! Isn't there any other explanation for why you couldn't channel a spirit? I just explained it! I suppose there's one other possibility. It's not very likely, though. Could you please tell me what it is, anyway? It could have been... It could happen if someone else was already channeling the same spirit. Someone else? What do you mean? Well, there's only one of each spirit, right? 
Yep, it's like dating a girl, Nick. You can't see a hot chick if she's already taken. <laughs> <laughs> then that would mean on the night of the murder, someone else channeled her spirit before Pearls could. Someone else channeled the spirit of Dahlia Hawthorne. Maybe it was... Maya. Maybe Maya channeled... Like, because Iris was in the Inner Temple. Maybe she was just like... Maya, in order to in in order to finish your training, you must channel this spirit. <laughs> like, <laughs> I'd like to tell you to go up to the main floor and fix the bubble. Yeah, exactly. Okay. I'm a failure. I couldn't even grant my mother's final wish. She's not. She didn't dead. deserve one. <laughs> Her final wish. Yes, this letter. This is my last wish. She said. So make sure you follow the instructions carefully. Hmm, this letter. I definitely need to find out more about it. Maybe Morgan was like, I'm so beautiful, I could totally stand in place for my daughter who's about to be executed. <laughs> um, your daughter's 26 and you are question mark. Oh my god! <laughs> Doesn't work that way. My mother has gone to a place to call a penitentiary. Penitentiary. I think it's better if she's pronounced uh, it wrong. <laughs> my mother's gone to a place called hell. <laughs> <laughs> you know those, yeah. those memes where it's like, they, they yeah. take out the word, put something in. <laughs> that would be great. <laughs> yeah, I know, Pearls. I visit her every month. You do? I mean... Because remember, you probably don't. It, back in the no, case where Morgan was the accomplice, Phoenix made Pearl channel Mia so she wouldn't see her, what her, a terrible person her mom was. Oh, Yeah. That would explain why she... I forgot about that. And she that. doesn't know the full extent of what Morgan did. No. Last month she told me... I need a refill on my paint, Pearl. <laughs> the time we've spent... Uh, I don't remember her voice. It's the fine. Time, <laughs> the time we've been waiting for has come, Pearl. There's something I need you to do for me. I hid a letter for you at our home before they brought me here. That long ago. Back so plan. In, so in a, yeah. So in other words, it's like oh, the doctor. I, I need to kill this person. She's like, I. She's like, this probably isn't gonna this work is out. Gonna work. <laughs> Back of plan. Back of plan. I'm gonna write this for Pearl <laughs> on this exact day of this thing. You're gonna. Go. I don't know how they planned it out. This to maybe, this detail. Maybe some of the letter was like, Pearl, you're gonna look into this place. You're gonna have Maya come here. Maybe. <laughs> maybe. I want you to read it and do exactly what it says. It's for the good of the Fae Clan, my angel. You'll be doing a great thing. Now listen carefully, and I'll tell you where the letter's hidden. It's probably in the Mystic Ami pot. The, that she broke. That she broke, <laughs> and then refixed for Adrian. And that got took into the treasure exhibit, and then <laughs> and broken broke again, again. And Adrian never found it. <laughs> no. And it got put back. <laughs> really small letter. <laughs> my mother's always nice to me. I love her so much. Yeah, moms will do anything for their kids, right? Anything. <laughs> <laughs> she said it was for the good of the Fae Clan, so I knew I had to help her. I mean, Mystic Maya's part of the Fae Clan, so it had to be good for her, too. That's right, isn't it, Mr. Nick? Uh, I guess so, yeah. There was a picture with her letter, too. A picture? Of Miss Dahlia Hawthorne. Usually a picture's enough to channel someone's spirit, but this time... Picture and name, actually. Pretty weird, huh? Like Larry knows anything about this stuff. There's something else that was strange about my mother's letter. The seal on it was broken as if someone had already opened it before. Probably Dolly was like... <laughs> <laughs> she was already in jail! <laughs> um... <laughs> nope. Sorry. I don't know. That sure maybe, is pretty strange. Maybe... Maybe she pulled in El Chapo, had some outside help. <laughs> Not El Chapo again. <laughs> Escaped. <laughs> Someone had opened it already? Burnt letter Maybe updated. Adrian in the Andrews department. opened it. <laughs> <laughs> no, this all this looks pretty important. Murder plot, better put it back. <laughs> <laughs> Who else would have opened it? <laughs> Thanks, Pearls. You really helped me out. You're very welcome. My mother's watching over us. So I'm sure Mystic Maya will be alright. Look at that innocent smile on her face. You say your mother's watching over us like she's in heaven, when it, uh, she's not. What am I supposed to say to her? Ha. <laughs> oh. You. Finally figured it out, have you, Trite? Like you figured it out! You finally realized how terrible the crime being painfully oblivious is. 
G Godot. The entrance to the sacred cavern looks like a freaking puzzle workshop. I guess he's talking about Iris and the lock breaking effort. But it's all a waste of time. Um. W why do you say that? Because Maya Faye isn't coming back. What? You don't know what you're talking about. How can you say something like that? It was your job to protect her trust. Okay, Godot, shut up. You're rude. <laughs> and you're being a butt. <laughs> Let him talk. <laughs> Just like it was your job to protect Mia Faye. Two sisters caught up in the worst circumstances. Whatever. I, I've realized that, but... And you were the only one who was by their sides. You were the only one who could have saved them. But I didn't know anything about what was going on. Ha. What did I just say, trite? Being oblivious is a heinous crime in itself. Tomorrow, we'll settle everything in court tomorrow. Once and for all. Okay, Godot. And then, and then he just disappears. Mr. Nick? Is... Is what that man just said true? It'll be alright, Pearls. I'm sure Maya's alive. You'll see for yourself tomorrow. I... Yeah, that's right. I know I can trust you, Mr. Nick. Yeah, this is not gonna end well. Somehow. My dear Pearl. You've done so well, my child. My Pearl. Hey, what's up? It's better that you don't know. Why I'm in jail and why I'm being a total <laughs> idiot! <laughs> I knew this day would come for you. The blood of the main family is no more. Now you... You are to take the place at the head of the Fey Clan. This is like Star Wars Episode 3. <laughs> <sighs> My last great wish. It seems I was just in time. I don't... This is... This is just... Why? This is, so, this is so ridiculous, and cool, and stupid, and I- Wow. Uh, okay, I, I just- What part of this, the fact that Pearl failed to do this, like, what part of that would have been like, Oh, you failed all of my instructions, and now my <laughs> face dead! It's like, how does that work? Maybe someone else, like, was also in on it. I'm just trying to think of who. Was Bikini just like, <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> Does, like, someone pop out of the sacred cavern that we've seen from forever ago where it's like, Holy crap, it's like it April, was... May! <laughs> and she's a spirit channeler. <laughs> she's a spirit channeler. That what would, are... okay, no, that's a twist that would be stupid. <laughs> <laughs> what are the odds? No, who else was, like, a spirit channeling whiz supreme that's alive? Uh, Misty Fay. But Misty Fay wouldn't try. Mia and... wasn't dead. <laughs> <laughs> that would be ridiculous. That would make no, no sense. But why would Misty Fay? Here's what I'm trying to figure She's out. She's gone a little say... loopy. In case let's say you Misty Fay would point. be like, "Oh yeah, I'm gonna kill off Maya. This would be, this would be great." <laughs> Reasons. <laughs> <laughs> Reasons. Like, why would it be like, "Yeah, we're gonna kill off Maya," and then they're just like, "You know what? We don't need you anymore." <laughs> Uh, well, I shed the blood. Maybe Pearl killed him sa or her. Saxon men. Or I called Misty Fay a guy. Sorry. Thanks Miss for Faith watching, dude. everyone. That's definitely gonna be two episodes. Mm -hmm. Tune in next time. The final trial. Like Godot said. Let's hope my voice is good because we'll settle I've had a lot tomorrow. of screams and a lot of <laughs> yep. child voices and a lot of complete surprised and. Anyhow, yeah. Case only gets better from here, actually. So, look forward to that next time. Until we In meet the again. trial? Oh, boy. Oh, we still haven't gotten all the twists yet. I'm sure. There's lots of Anyhow, twists Anyhow, have trials. a great day, and God bless.